monitoring and analytics play in a modern retailing environment? There are two ways of looking at it. One way is simply achieving a better understanding of what uh, your customers are looking for, what your customers' needs are, and tailoring then your product offering and your experience, digital experience, based on that deeper understanding. That's one way of looking at it, and I, I think that's probably still what the majority of airlines and probably still the majority of retailers in general are doing. There is another way of looking at it, which is the increase in footprint and uh, just the increase in how common uh, artificial intelligence is becoming and machine learning is becoming. It, it probably no longer makes sense to uh, look at the cycle of product improvement only as a matter of let's understand what people need and want and we then go away and build what they need and want. Uh, we are starting probably to already and I think all the technology vendors who want to stay ahead of the curve uh, have to switch to the to thinking around how you can automate continuous improvement based on uh, automatically generated insights and uh, essentially uh, applying, uh, user, leveraging machine learning and artificial intelligence to automatically determine what is the best thing to do and then applying that effect if you can. This obviously requires quite a lot of re-architecting and changing changes in even at organizational level. You need to trust your solution to make retailing decisions and experience design decisions on your behalf as a retailer. You trust a machine to make decisions which today are taken by a human. Uh, but I, I believe that this is the direction in which things are heading and what today still feels, you know, maybe unnatural or uh, unsafe to do without human supervision. My expectation is that soon it will become the norm. Uh, and we have architected Trip Lake in such a way that uh, we can, for example, execute um, uh, machine learning models automatically to apply uh, different effects on the front end, learn from that effect, like multi, uh, sorry, multi armed bandit strategy, and uh, apply effects automatically, which leads to a system that is continuously self improving, of course, within some limits. It's within the limits of the rules that the system is allowed to experiment with. But this leads to uh, the transformational effect that you don't even need to understand yourself anymore what people want and need. The system understands that better than any human possibly could.